I reckon, I tell you, you know, going around that hairpin like he's done and got caught up with the slower cars, you know, it's, it's virtually inevitable you're going to get tangled up. Um, it's just a shock to me, you know, <laughs> up here and actually watching it uh, happen. Just, uh, it just developed in front of us. Yeah, well, Chris, it's obviously a good car to drive. It's not bad. It's not bad. I tell you. And I, there's a lot of envious people out there. You know, uh, I've talked to a lot of people and they've said, hey, that's a great thing. But tell you what, getting out there and just putting your foot down in a, in a, in a big V8, you know, it really does give me a bit of a buzz. Well, look at the attitudes of the car. He's really trying now. It's, um, this car, I tell you, has is, is got a lot of, um, a little bit of body roll, but it really picks the inside wheels up. Just talk us around a lap. Give us what gear he's in, the sort of speeds he's doing. Well, he's coming out there in second and squeezing it up into third. He'll, if he's if he's on a go, he'll be back to second. But he, no, he's keeping it in third through here, through the gates, through third, looking for fourth, seven and a half thousand RPM. And if he hits the left rev limit, he'll hear it. Da -da -da -da, but he, no, he's, he's keeping it under seven uh, seven six, under the Tate Communications bridge here, and then through the uh, well, very light chicane. But you can squeeze through there in third gear. This is a hard one. Round the outside, excuse me, I'm coming through. Down Cable Street, it's really nice and smooth. Very, very easy to uh, to drive. Looking for big black marks where that's the start of the braking area. Go back from, uh, from fifth, third, back to second through here. Um, throwing it left to right. The inside wheels pick up. You can, this is the one for me. Up the inside, through the ASB corner. As you go through there, the wheels are absolutely in the air. Coming out, getting it sideways. And th again, this is a, a difficult one. Trying to go through there in third, um, it just makes it a little bit easier. Second's a bit too hard up against the fence. Looking for uh, fourth gear. He'll hold fourth through here, slower traffic. Which way do I go? Left, right or over the top? I'll go to the left, thanks. Um, braking, not a pro this is a very hard corner to go through because it's very hard to pick up the, uh, the apexes. There's a bit of a kink that comes out there and left half the mobile side on it. And through the uh, peanut slab bridge and onto the main straight. Well, there you are. There's a lap with Peter Brock and commentated by Graham Crosby. The two boys doing a job. And look at Brocky. Got it cranked up and going hard. Well, Brock turning it on for the race fans here. There's still plenty of action to come. The race is winding down. But, of course, we'll go back to Tony Longhurst. We'll go back to the Porsches. We'll be going back to Paul Radisich. Stay with us, New Zealand. They're in the top places for you. Back shortly.